Hey guys, welcome to Click Tool Academy. My name is Alex. In this video, I'm gonna review the results from ads I set up in the episode number four. So let's switch to my laptop and I will show you that. Our previous set of ads was rejected. Sometimes ads with an affiliate marketing offer can get flagged. The problem can be in your link, landing page, creatives or text copy. In my case, the problem was with the link. So after today's my campaign, I created a new campaign and changed the link to proteinpeak.com instead of proteinpeak.com slash February. Here is this link. Also, I added some uh, adjustments to my landing page. So I added reviews and trusted by YouTubers section to increase the trustworthiness of this landing page. So this is how it looks like. Now let's break down and analyze the results we got from this campaign. I ran ads in the period from 28th of February till the 1st of March and my spend were $195.89 and I got only one sale which gave me the commission of $30. Let's change column settings to targeting and creative. Now I'm going to the ads tab. From this breakdown, you can see that the highest relevant score have ads with the following targeted keywords. 24 hour fitness has a relevant score of 7. Men's fitness, premier protein and protein bar have a relevant score of 6. Other ads you see here are low performing, so we can disregard them. The total amount of clicks are 62. Most of the clicks we got from targeting on premier protein and 24 hour fitness. Let's make an in-depth breakdown for each of them. From targeting on Premier Protein, we got 1194 impressions. The cost for 1000 impressions is $26.97. We got 19 link clicks and have 1.59% click-through rate. The average link click is $1.69. From targeting on 24 hour fitness, we got 2091 impressions. The cost for 1000 impressions is $18.57. And also we got 27 link clicks and have 1.29% click through rate. The average link click is $1.44. So these two ads we can declare as potential winners. Now let's summarize everything. I will need to try new creatives and text copies. Due to limitation of Facebook analytical tools, I will need to set up click tool tracking software so I can see an in-depth report and I will show you how you can get accurate analytical data and then save your money on ads. After I figure out which targeting keywords might have potential, I will need to find and add a few more related to competitors of my product and gym networks. In the next video, I will show you how to stop click tool tracking software. You will see the difference why most of the people get a results like this campaign and how to avoid that. Also, we will try new creatives, text copies and targeted keywords. Thank you for watching guys, I hope you really enjoyed this video and found useful information here. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. See you in the next video. Adios!